Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum everyone. In this video tutorial, we are going to consider register open addressing mode. In previous video tutorials, we have considered, considered and answered the question what is addressing mode and what is immediate open addressing mode. So in this video tutorial, we are uh, considering a new uh, uh, addressing mode and that is register open addressing mode. So in this, uh, uh, in this uh, addressing mode, the key thing is that both source operand and destination operands are registers. So we need, uh, it's very easy to predict if we have given an instruction, we need to know and we need to consider whether their uh, source operand or destination operands are registers or not. If they are registered, there, there is no doubt about it that a specific instruction is using register operand addressing mode. For example, we can give an instruction, move, ax comma bx what is it uh, if you see uh, the meaning of this instruction is the move the content of bx to ax so bx is what uh, bx is the source operand and ax is what destination operand right so that means both of the operand either it is source or destination, both of them are AX, uh, sorry, both of them are register, uh, which means uh, this specific instruction, let me highlight the instruction. This instruction is using register operand addressing mode, right? Uh, if we consider another example, let's say we are writing move AL comma zero four hacks. So what is, is it, uh, register operand addressing mode or not? No, it is not register operand addressing mode because uh, one of the content is basically uh, zero four hex, which is immediate value, not the register. So here we can say that the destination is L, which is a register, okay, but zero four hex is not a register, it is an immediate value. So this instruction is not a, a register operand addressing mode uh, uh, example of instruction, right? Uh, let's take an exa another example, let's say we write move a l comma b l is it register operand addressing mode instruction yes because this instruction is using uh, the both of them uh, operands i mean both of the operands source operand or destination operand both of them are register so this instruction is using uh, register uh, operand addressing mode right uh, let's take an example from the software point of view uh, Okay, again, if we uh, we are considering the uh, same kind of example, uh, the IP value and the CS value was giving, if we calculate the physical address of the next instruction, it will be 0, 1000 hacks. And the instruction is move AX comma BX, which means BX value will be moved inside the AX register. And this is a register operand addressing mode. And in case of binary or machine code, it is equal to 8BC3. So this instruction will take two bytes. One will be stored 0, 1000, another will be stored at 0, 1001, right? So if we execute, what is going to happen? Whatever the BX value, what is the BX value? BX value is A, B, C, D. It will be moved inside the AX register. So let's see if it is going to happen or not. So if we execute the instruction, what is going to happen? Uh, one can easily see that uh, the AX value is updated, right? This value, which was BX value is now moved into AX, right? And furthermore, IP is incremented by two because uh, these two bytes are already consumed. So now IP is provided to the next uh, next instruction, which is 0, 1002. And 0, 1002 can be cal calculated using CSN IP values. Uh, I hope you have understand the concept of register operand addressing mode. Still, if you have any query or confusion, you can post those confusions and queries in comment section. Thank you so much for listening.